Hey guys, this is Davo from Arkon Esports bringing you what are we bringing them today? We are bringing the ESL UK Nationals, Blizzard ESL UK Nationals from London, England. With some very, very hot StarCraft 2 talent playing. Indeed, we have there's Bling, there's the Muslim, there's Johnny Rico, um, there's anyone that you would have seen it. Zigdomini, yeah. that's looking good. Um, yeah, no, it should be a really good, it should be a really, a really good, good tournament. We're going to have a little look around and chat with some people about, you know, how they feel about the ESL and what's going on, and you know how they think UK esports can take off in the future and stuff like that. So stay tuned. Stay tuned. Hi guys, it's Phonix here from Archon Esports. I'm here with Richard at the ESL UK Nationals. Uh, what do you think of this event? Have you been to many before? Uh, actually, this is my first big event and I really enjoy it. It's really good. It's a very good feeling that it's come to the UK. And um, I just hope that it grows more. What do you guys think of this event? It's brilliant. It's, it's the first event I've been to and I think it's the first one in the UK. So it's, it's been a pleasure to be here really. It's, it's been great. <laughs> yeah, it's been really good. They've got some really good players here. I'm surprised with Bling and Muslim both being knocked into the lower bracket, but it's been a really good event. But definitely it's... worth doing more events in London. Yeah, definitely. What do you think of the UK sort of crowd and stuff compared to other crowds you might have seen on streams and stuff? Um, it seems really good, really good, yeah. I mean. Yeah, good natured, like laugh there's like jokes, everyone's laughing and yeah. I've noticed there has been a lot more sort of laughter coming from the crowd when the casters have been saying stuff which I haven't ever seen in any other event and stuff like across from the UK, but um for how small it is, it seems to be quite a like a high sort of yeah. revved crowd. Everyone seems really happy to be here and stuff. Good banter. Yeah, good banter. Yeah. Um how many of these events do you usually attend or is this your first one? Um, well, this is my worst, like, uh, sorry, my first World well, Cyber uh, Series, but um, I've been to some British land, the I-Series and stuff before, uh, which I've really enjoyed, but there's not really been much of a scene in the UK um, for sort of eSports events and stuff. So I'm really glad that this one's happened, and especially in, in London, and that they've got Tastosis and everyone's cast it, and yeah, it's really great. So uh, I'm really pleased to be here, and I've been here both days, and it's been great. Um, do you like the fact that, well you obviously like the fact that more events are coming to the UK, yeah, but there just aren't that many sort of out there at the moment. Um, do you have sort of any thoughts about that, or do you think, it's, is it the crowd, is it the players, like is it the people watching, or what do you think is the problem with it not being quite as big as everywhere else? I think in the UK if you play video games, it's a very insulted hobby. No, like, if You can't say, oh I play computer games with pride. Like, if you say, oh, I play StarCraft, everyone's like, what? And, like, and if you explain it, they just think you're a, a geek. So, yeah, it's very hard to actually, you know, say what your hobbies are and get, you know, friends that do the same thing without being judged for it. Yeah, yeah I could say the same thing. But um, I think it just needs more time to mature. That's it, really. We've just watched the final. It was intense. The whole, everything's been intense here. Um, we've met some really cool people. We got to meet Tastosis, which made me a little. Uh, I got a little bit. But um, yeah, what do you? Uh, I personally think that it has been a bit of an upset. I don't know. I, I feel like I feel like the favourites to win didn't win, and of course that always makes for really really interesting tournaments uh, because obviously my favourites were the Muslim and Bling. I thought it was going to be a Muslim and Bling final, but no, 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 it ended up to be Zikto Ziktomini. 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 It's not that hard to say, or the red I had some trouble with it. Yeah, red but, I had um, trouble. 